Greetings, Pies families. Hoping you are all healthy, safe, and well. We know you have many questions about your child returning to school. So we wanna assure you that we are doing everything possible to keep students and staff safe as we return to in-person learning. This video will walk you through the new safety procedures for entering and exiting the building, as well as while you're moving around throughout the building. We look forward to having you back and hope that everyone will watch this video and familiarize themselves with the new procedures so that we can all stay safe. So remember to keep social distance, wash your hands frequently, and mask up to stop the spread. It is extremely important that we adhere to the following protocols for everyone's safety and well-being. Finish all food and drink before entering the building. You must also be properly masked before entering the building. Then stop. Read the attestation statement aloud. Have you been diagnosed to have novel coronavirus within the last 14 days? No. If any questions you answer, yes, stop. Do not enter the building and alert security or the nurse for further instructions. If all answers are no, proceed to the next step. Take your temperature at the mobile thermometer station at the entrance. Look for the displayed reading. If under 100 degrees, green light and one beat, proceed to the next step. Step onto the shoe decontamination mat. Step off the shoe decontamination mat and onto carpet to dry shoes. Wash hands thoroughly with hand sanitizer. After your hands have been sanitized, proceed to the security desk and show your ID. While walking through the building, be sure to follow directional signs such as one way or six feet apart on the floor. When speaking with a peer or adult, maintain six feet distancing at all times and avoid congregating in groups. Proceed to your locker, then the first class of the day. Should you need to use the bathroom at any point during the day, bathrooms will be limited to two students at a time. School water fountains are currently disabled, so be sure to bring a personal water bottle for your hydration. The school's cafeteria is closed. Food will be provided at dismissal, lunch for that day, and breakfast for the next morning from exit locations. Students will exit from the closest of two exits, either the student exit or the nurse's office on Rock Avenue. A, D, and science wings will exit Rock Avenue. Thank you all for listening. Your principals and teachers are all excited about your return. Following these simple guidelines will help us all to remain healthy and safe. See you soon.